morning, everybody. I'm Miss Blessed to be a blessing, and this is my reading for my Sagittarius. Hey, that's right, juvenile. Sing it. I like it like that. She working that back. I don't know how to act. Hey, yeah. So much of me move, so much of me. Ooh, I like it like that. She working that back. Oh. Slow muscle for me, slow muscle for me, eh. Slow muscle for me, hey. Her neck and her back hurt, eh. Eh. Hop up on top and say chicky chicky turkey, eh. And I'ma make it get off me. Let me bury my bone. I got four or five bad, bad bitches at home. One of my bitches fell in love with my outside dick. That outside dick. Keep them hoes sick like, ooh. <laughs> All right, Sagittarius. Let me get it to God reading. Because why don't I be doing some crazy shit and we're not get finished with the reading. Anyway, you guys, so I see that some of you are very guarded in regard to some things that are going on. Some of y'all have been going through it, been in your emotions. They've been up and down and all kind of stuff going on with y'all. Some of y'all not sleeping at night. You're worried about some things that are going on. Um, Dreams, whenever you do go to sleep, you have kind of like mm, short sleeps is what I'm saying, short sleeps. You're definitely thinking about somebody here. You feel like you don't have to defend yourself against others. You know, took somebody else to hell and back. Because some of y'all say the chairs be off the chain. Yes, y'all do. Y'all be reckless with y'all mouth and shit. And be saying that kind of shit out y'all mouth to people. And I mean, you have people like saying like, what? No, the fuck you did not say that to me. What the fuck is going on? But anyway, the moon card is here. And the moon card is saying that you're going to get clarity in regards to some things that are going on in your life. The secrets that are hidden will come to the light. I do see a fire sign here coming into your life. Could be a little sage of Aries that's coming towards you. Or you could be dealing with them. Some of you could be reminiscing about your past here, Sagittarius. The high pieces she sees all, she knows all. She don't talk much. But she's very intuitive. That's how you are. You're very intuitive. Some of y'all are very, very spiritual. Y'all got so much stuff going on around you that you can't really see something for right in your face. Whatever it is, hey, you'll figure it out. The next thing you have here... The Queen of Pentacles talks about being blessed from the universe and things like that. You see, this is a beautiful card. You see, money is coming in. Yep, you've been working hard and it's going to pay off for you. I see some of y'all need to make a head of hard decision. Don't know exactly what to do. You need to uncross yourself to the universe. Open yourself up and take that damn blindfold off so you can see that there's a Leo here surrounding you. And all I can see right now, y'all just won't happen. If some of y'all dealing with a toxic situation, or some of y'all just sexually attracted to somebody, somebody fucking body sexually attracted to you, shit. Yes, the fuck they is. They could be obsessing about you, thinking about you, but they can't eat, can't sleep and no shit either. Thinking about your ass or vice versa. Or both of y'all doing the same motherfucking thing. It is what it is. This sexual attraction is so damn powerful. It's like, well, goddamn, y'all don't even saying the same thing. Anyway, there's a partnership here that I see here. So there will be a new partnership coming in, and you do want the happy home life and things of that sort. If y'all can work that out, y'all can get together, is what I'm saying. Some of y'all stuck, don't know exactly what to do in regard to something here. There's a water sign surrounding you here. You could be going with the Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces, or they could just be thinking about you. You're thinking about the Empress card, say, birthing out something new and exciting. Somebody could definitely be pregnant. Now, Empress can also say you birthed out businesses and things of that sort as well. But it's like new opportunities just open up doors and wait of opportunity opening for you. have been waiting a while for something. You're waiting. What the fuck you waiting for, Sagittarius? Please tell me. Hmm. Okay. Here you are, Sagittarius. Mm -hmm. Y'all be watching and looking. You know, y'all very knowledgeable because y'all always checking up on things. You know how y'all do. Very knowledgeable. Very brash. Some of y'all very brash. Y'all words that come out your mouth, you'll be like, what? That make you want to look three, four times back and say, what the fuck did they just say? Shit, wait a minute, hold up, hold up. Rewind that shit. Anyway, um <laughs> some of y'all feel this though you've been carrying heavy loads here. And with the full card here is saying that there's definitely gonna be a new beginning. You're not afraid to take risks in your life, and that's a great thing. And I see plenty of offers coming in for you. Plenty of people are very um like you, you're very likable. 
Um, some of y'all could be celebrities in the spotlight and things of that sort. Definitely have a problem saying what you mean to me, but you say it is what the fuck it is. There could be some magic taking place. Somebody casting spells on you or you casting spells on them. Communication is definitely going to take place. I see that's coming up. Yes, child. Yes, yes, yes. Somebody's very much so. You see this? Somebody is watching somebody. Finances coming in. Somebody has open arms. They waiting for somebody to come in. They waiting for you. This is a Leo card again. Some of y'all need sprint in order to deal with somebody who you're definitely in love with here. And I do see your ships coming in on the rise and say the chairs, but some of y'all have to deal with some heartache and pain and disappointment. Some of y'all dealing with also some type of um, competition here. You're wearing your options in regard to some things that are going to, maybe you have two people you're dealing with or two jobs or two sons. Y'all always busy. It's all about giving and taking, though. You got to realize that. And I do see you plant seeds. It's definitely going to grow for you here. Say the chairs. I do see new beginnings here. It's the Ace of Cups. New beginnings, overflowing, love is going to be overflowing, doors of opportunity opening up to you. You've been working extremely hard, it's going to pay out for you here, but yeah, you're still in your mind. You're, you're bounded up in your mind, feeling trapped, don't know what to do about something, can't see clearly for looking. I'm excited, Terrence. I'm supposed to be a blessing. Y'all have a blessed day. Thank you.